Hey guys, and welcome back to CPR's Kitchen. And today I wanted to share with you how to make your own cake flour. I know that you're here because you're just like me. Sometimes you just don't want to buy something just to use it for one time, especially if you're not a baker that bakes a lot. Now, I bake a lot, but I like to share videos that can help people who just want to try something for a special occasion or to make a good treat for themselves and their families to not have to spend their coins. So this is another baking coin saving hack how to make your own cake flour so let's get into it those are the only two ingredients you're going to need and let me show you how simple and easy this is continue watching all right so you're going to need a tablespoon a leveler or a knife butter knife anything to level off your measuring cup a measuring cup a sifter and your bowl to make your cake flour in so let's get started all right, so the reason for me doing this is because I need cake flour to create my moist, tasty lemon cupcakes. Now, with that being said, it's so simple. For every cup of flour, you remove two tablespoons of the flour and replace it with two tablespoons of cornstarch. So let's begin. Okay, guys, so when you are leveling the cup of flour, do that in a bowl. When you are leveling the tablespoon of flour that you are removing from the cup of flour, you level that over the cup, okay? So level the cup over the bowl, level the tablespoon over the cup. And next, you just take the cornstarch, level that into the cornstarch jar, and put the four tablespoons into the bowl with the flour. I use cake flour because it makes the actual texture of your cupcakes and your cakes so freaking moist. So now that we got our starch and our flour in here, and this is basically two cups of cake flour, but you're not done. Now, if you don't have a sifter, you can actually take this, put this in a bowl, and basically you're aerating it and mixing it up together really well. That is it. That is the only reason why you do this step, which is very important. If you have one of these, you could have kept it in a bowl and basically all you have done is just put it in a bowl and just keep mixing it, mixing it, mixing it, mixing it, mixing it around. I would say I mix it at least like 50 times around, but I'm going to do it the simple way because I do have a sifter and I'm going to sift this three times. So we're going to put it in once. So this would be once and this to make sure there's no lumps or anything like that. And what you can do, see how the lumps just go through? So that's once. So we're going to do it two more times. And that is how you make cake flour, guys. This video is really helpful. Now you have created your own cake flour and you don't have to waste money buying a whole five, 10 pound bag of cake flour. You can do it yourself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If so, thumbs up. If you have any questions, leave them below and check out my playlist that should be up in the sky somewhere of all of my great cooking recipes. And make sure if you are new that you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you are alert every time I put up a new video. And I will see you guys later, Gator.